Well, hey, welcome. Good morning. Hope you're doing well. Bio Nanogenomics is up. Look at this chart. Pre-market. See this yellow line, this happy yellow sun-colored line? That means that Bio Nanogenomics closed yesterday at $10.75 and in pre-market is at $12.61. They just published a new study. And that's what I want to talk about with you in this video. So we're going to jump right in again. My name is Richard Allen. We talk about stocks on this channel. And BNGO, Bio Nanogenomics, is one of my favorite companies to talk about. And you guys probably know why. One of these reasons is they're doing a lot of research on cancer. And they, they, this study that we're going to talk about is fantastic. Now, again, full disclosure. I am not a geneticist. Most of these terms will be way over my head, and I am the first to admit it. So please forgive me if I mispr mispronounce something. That's funny that I mispronounced mispronounced. Mince pronounced. <sighs> I've only had about a quarter of my coffee so far, so it's not it's not in my blood yet. Forgive me. But let's jump right over to the article. Bio Nanogenomics announces publication of study that measured DNA methylation of various regions regulating cancer genes on single DNA modules. So there it is. This is a first this is actually a first of its kind study. Sapphire study is first to analyze cancer regulation at level of single DNA molecules opens promising new avenue of cancer research so no wonder now this news i'm recording this about an hour after this news came out this news came out at, this morning at 7 11 in the morning um and thanks to one of my discord members um uh, i i saw this early early this morning and i got really really excited this study was led by dr ebenstein at the tel aviv university and they found that optical genome mapping with bio nanos sapphire system combined with a custom labeling method developed by the scientists was capable of analyzing regulatory regions that work together to turn cancer genes on and off over distances of hundreds of thousands of base pairs. The ability to measure these relationships on single DNA molecules is something that was previously impossible. Only Sapphire can detect these long distance connections in methylation profiles because it's the only technology that can generate such long range single molecule data at high throughput and coverage. I know there's a lot of people out there that are still skeptical of bio nanogenomics because look, just a month ago, a month ago, about this time a month ago, a month and a half ago, Bio Nanogenomics, BNGO stock, they were in fears of being delisted. Delisted from the stock exchange because they were trading under a dollar for a certain amount of time. And they got an extension. They had the symposium and on and on and on. And now the stock is going through the roof. As you guys know, I did put this in my long-term portfolio. I'm up about 140% on this investment. A lot of you have made much, much more with bio nanogenomics, but I think, I really do think this is just the beginning. I think this will be a $30 stock by the end of the year. I think we're going to continue to see studies like this be published and come out over and over again. So remember, we saw, we saw similar price action to Pacific Biosciences last year. And again, Kathy Wood has come out and said, hey, um, this is going to be the year of genomics. Now, um, she may not have exactly said that, and I'm sure someone will correct me in the comments. You guys are good at doing that. Um, <laughs> but uh, in, and, uh, in ARK Invest Big Ideas of 2021, uh, it, bio nanogenomics was mentioned twice in that awesome pdf it was a fantastic document if you haven't read it already uh look it up online it's um there's a lot of really really cool information on there now on that page where they mentioned bio nanogenomics only one of those companies arc doesn't own right now that's bio nanogenomics also illumina technically they've owned in the past they've sold out of their position but um 
there's a good chance that BNGO will be part of the ARC G fund. However, even if it isn't, that doesn't negate the fantastic research, the fantastic potential that is bio-nanogenomics and their Sapphire system. It doesn't even if they're not part of the arc g fund it, it, it this this is still an exciting technology that i i i feel like a lot of us not us because i'm not a lot of you guys are are placing your bets that hey arc g is going to buy into it if they don't i think this company is still going to be a good company in the future they're a good company now they're doing some amazing things clearly right this first of its kind study um, i want to go through a little bit more of it here um, in my uh, terrible understanding of genomics, but I want to go over through um, Dr. Ebenstein's uh, comment as well um, and, uh, and a, a little bit more of the information. This is really, really, really cool stuff. It really, really is cool. Um, and to be able to get closer to understanding cancer um, is absolutely amazing. Now, market just opened. Um, I, did, I did put this, I, I put BNGO on my watch list today. But I said, I specifically said, it has. It, there's been some great information released today on BNGO, but be careful, it's run, ran up a lot pre-market. And what we'll sometimes see with pre-market, and I'm leaving this up so you guys can see the price move. We'll see news come out. We'll see very excited early investors come in. They'll jump in, they'll drive the price up. We'll see it fall a little bit as some of those swing traders, day traders, those kind of people come in and they take their profits. And then we'll see retail investors drive the price up a little bit more again. So that seems to be what's happening right now with BioNanogenomics um, because we saw it drop down to um, close to like $12, right? Um, so from like $12.60. So that, that's just probably normal profit taking but I, I i did say hey be careful with this one because um i don't want you guys to be caught holding the bag if it does drop down now a lot of times uh stocks will fill gaps um so there's a chance it'll run up and then come back down to this level this this is where it consolidated i think if if the new low is like 1070 this 1050 to 1070 level i mean this is a really really good um support for this uh for this stock here so um but let's jump right back into the article here let's go over the statement from dr ebenstein it says long methylation I'm, I, I'm probably butchering that word forgive me i'm gonna purposely mess up the rest of the words okay no i'm just kidding um it, it, long methylation reads at such high coverage just never existed before mostly because sapphire produces the highest fraction of the longest reads compared to any other platform the data set allows us to analyze long-range information on the single molecule level, which opens a whole new avenue of complex disease-specific epigenetic biomarkers. This study can be dramatic for early cancer diagnostics, where the normal and cancer cells have a very similar genetic background, but the extreme changes in enhancer methylation distinguish the cancer cells. This data may for the first time allow us to discover new biomarkers and point to novel drug targets in places of the genome where no one has looked before. This is fantastic news. It really, really is fantastic news. We, we, we've talked about a few times, right? How this, this isn't just a tool for geneticists to use and study the genome. This is increasingly, it's be increasingly becoming apparent that this is a diagnostic tool. We continue to hear it over and over again. A diagnostic tool. That massively changes the total addressable market for bio-nanogenomics. Like, like, a lot. Like, orders of magnitude. I, I don't even know what that means. Um, but seriously, it, it totally changes their total addressable market. By probably like 4 or 5x. It's a big, big change from, uh, from what we know. So, as studies like this continue to come out, and as more and more hospitals, doctors, institutions get on this bandwagon and realize that this is a diagnostic tool, uh, I, I, that's an exciting. That's going to be an exciting uh, time for for the stock. It really will. I, I think um, this is going to have a long, long life, a long, long run ahead of them. I'm I'm excited. I'm really, really excited. You guys know that. You know I like BNGO. 
Um, let's jump back over to the chart and see how it's doing. Um, we are back above $12. We did drop below $12 for a little bit. We'll see. I think more and more people are losing their diamond hands and they're <laughs> jumping back into other stocks. And I think that's what we're seeing across the board. But hey, I could be wrong. I don't know. But guys, that is all I have for you on Bio Nano Genomics. Thank you so much for joining me for another video. I appreciate you. Um, we have had a tremendous, tremendous amount of people join the Patreon and the Discord over the last couple days. And if you're watching this and you join, I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you so much. Thank you for being patient. It takes about a day uh, to get access to the Discord. Uh, Patreon is a mess on the first of the month. So um, I appreciate everyone's patience. Thank you so much. But I'm excited to have you uh, part of be part of the community. Remember, um, I, I, I would love to have you over there. If you're serious about trading and investing, if you're serious about even if you don't know anything, if you're serious about learning, I would love to have you be a part of that community. Um, I keep hearing from people that we're building one of the best communities on Discord. Um, and again, I'm not saying that. People on Discord are saying that. Um, but I'm, I'm excited uh, to be a part of the community. I really, really, really am. Um, so if you want to get live trading updates from me when I do trade, if you want to get a watch list from me that I update pretty much every day, um, please consider joining. I would love to have you over there. And remember, spots are going to be limited. We're going to get to the point where we're only doing referral and invitation only. So if you want to be part of the community before that happens, um, this month is probably your last month. That would be my guess. So again, guys, thank you so much for joining me for another video. I'm Richard Allen. If you didn't already do it, click that beautiful red subscribe button down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.